Welcome to the part two where we're gonna sculpt the nose. Um, so let's just go. The third thing I see that I'm not gonna have enough of vertices. So I'm just gonna increase. I'm being cautious on how much I'm gonna put in. I'm gonna try putting. Yeah, I think that's enough. Zero point zero two five. I'm just gonna smooth the shapes because after adding more vertices, everything is very flat. Now it much better. I'm just gonna change a matte cap, and you as well should try and test out a lot of different matte caps you have, and choose the one you like. If you like mine, I'm gonna put in the link on where you can get it. Okay, so let's start with the nose. I'm gonna just use the clay strip to draw the shape. Only worry about the bridge. When you have something poking through the mesh, you can go to the side view and use the grab tool. So now we can see, we can see what the nose bridge actually is doing. There's a few, few ways you can draw a nose bridge shape. I'm gonna I'm gonna show the one I like. So the head usually goes, okay, sorry. The head usually goes quite, quite overly shaped. And the nose comes in being quite flat and having a nice, nice drop line. It can definitely be drawn a lot of different ways but try to follow my shape it's gonna be a bit easier you can have a bit of the inner side have a bump so don't worry too much but try to to stay close to my shape okay I'm gonna take out a bit from the side so we're gonna have a flatter surface to work with which is gonna be a bit easier for us to control I'm gonna smooth it everything looks very uh, same thickness which is good for now um, when you have a bridge go to the side view and use the brush you like, I'm gonna use the clay strips and draw like a ball shape. Don't worry too much on how big you draw, you always have a a grab tool. I'm gonna add some more to the side the bump now I can draw the holes I'm gonna use the scope draw it's very good for making the holes I'm gonna make the nose bottom a bit more flatter the poking of the nose because nose can be straight but I like to add a bit, a bit of the bump at the end make it a bit more thicker I 
I already can see that I'm gonna like a bit of the vertices, so I'm very slowly gonna try increasing. Okay, 300 is a lot, but it should be okay. It shouldn't be too hard to control it yet. I'm gonna use draw sharp and draw in the whole nose shape. So what people usually miss about the nose um, is that the nose actually from this it goes in into nose and it has this entering it can be very minimalistic visible but it's usually still there I'm gonna just draw on the surface I'm gonna still thicken this another thing is that usually the thickness of the nose should be quite sim same through through all the side of the nose mine is a bit thicker but I'm just gonna increase the size of the nostrils don't be afraid to smooth but just don't use it too much on where you're gonna lose So we have a pretty simple nose which looks decent okay next one I'm gonna start with the eyes so just see you in the next episode